so today's video is what I'm going to call the Real Talk series, where I just share what's going on with me, what I'm feeling, and it's unedited, unscripted, and just to hope to have you feel like I'm going through the same shit. So grab your drink of choice, let's get started. So if you're new here, welcome. My name is Karen, I'm the Body and Mind Transformation Coach for Women with ADHD. I help you thrive in your body, both physically and mentally so you can do all the things your brain is calling you to do like going on a weekend hike with friends and knowing that you can keep up you have the stamina or going to a fitness class randomly that sounds lots of fun and you know you feel confident to show up and yeah be able to participate and really enjoy it and I help you do all of that without it feeling like this obsession or a task on your to-do list but really just a natural part of so that's a bit about me, but let's talk about God, my day, my morning. You know when you wake up those days where you're like, oh brain, there's a full on party going up in there, full on monkey mind, and sometimes it's just a day, sometimes it's a week, sometimes it, it's weeks and weeks and goes into months and it's for a really long period of time where you just, whatever you try, you just like you can't stop it your mind's just going all the directions and you know you want to harness it and focus but you just can't. So I do a lot of mindfulness work. Um, I do different types of meditation and on those days I'm like I, I need to meditate. I know this is gonna be good. I need to find my mindfulness practice and I can't. It's just so much. There's so much going on in the head. It's just high energy but it's not this energy that is needed to be spent physically all the time, if you know what I mean. So on those days, those are the days that I really am so happy for my fitness system I've created. But even if you don't have that, those are the days that I definitely move my body first thing in the morning. So as soon as I get up and I can feel my brain just all the directions, it's not even, okay, I'm gonna do my little routine before I go work out. It's literally put on my shoes, get outside. Hey Luna, and I go move my body in whatever way feels best. Something to get out of your head, feel into your body, and something that's so absorbed with both body and mind that you're finding this flow. So I want you to think when those mornings happen, what can you do to go move your body that's super accessible? is going to engage your body and mind. It's not going to let your mind wander. It's really going to engage your body physically so you're focused on your body moving. And that feels fun. So for me, it's little, I talk about this often, running hills. Because all I need to do is throw on my shoes. I get out of my house into my car to go drive to the hill. And so that way I'm not getting distracted by everything in my house. It's really short, so I don't need to eat like a meal before I go. I can just have a drink of water and head out there. And I like running, but if I just do a flat basic run, my mind is just gonna go all the directions. I'm like, I can't, I just can't right now. I need to pause my mind. But running hills is so engaging because it gets the higher intensity workout that I'm so focused on moving as fast as I can and breathing that I don't have time to listen to what my thoughts are and it gives me a lot of clarity and perspective. So maybe for you that's literally having a dance party. Maybe it's getting outside and going for a walk in nature. Maybe it's a full workout. I mean, I love lifting weights for finding that meditative flow where you're focused so much on the muscles and joints moving and coordinating that and you're not focused on what's happening in your head and all the thoughts and the pings back and forth. What feels fun, what's accessible, and what can you do as soon as you get up? Why not start your day feeling on top of the world, feeling in control, relaxed, organized, and focused? Even when you wake up and not feeling that way, you can still regain control. So I challenge you, actually I'm telling you, to go move your body as soon as you wake up when you're having one of those days. And even if you're having a great day, still go move your body. And if you want more tips, help, and all the things to start your day feeling calm, relaxed, and in control, then I invite you to grab my freebie. I'll link it below. It's for 15-minute morning and night routine. They're my go-to that I use. I 
a bit more intuitive, so sometimes I change it day to day, night by night, but there are my 15 minute go-tos that uh, I want to give to you. And finally, the work I do is my mission, it's my passion, it's my purpose to help you achieve your own goals with your fitness and your health. So yeah, you feel confident in your body. You can go on that weekend hike and have the stamina to keep up. And movement and eating healthy, nutritious foods is just something that is a regular part of your life. And you're not held back by the limiting beliefs, the mindset blocks, and you're not self-sabotaging anymore. Because you know what to do, it's just doing it, right? So if you feel called to take a step forward, and really, really change, make lasting changes for your mindset and your physical health. I invite you to check out the details and apply for my fitness identity course. I'll link it below. It's a signature 12 week program. It's transformational for both body and mind and it is truly magical. So I invite you to check out the details and you can book a call to learn more. Okay guys, I'll see you all next week.